treasure hidden out there in the fence. God, we've got to hear him on the tannoy. Just stop talking to him, can't we? Can't he just shut up? That sounded like he was just talking as well. Like he stood at the front desk just randomly playing a xylophone down the, uh, down the tannoy. Okay, what's going on here? Okay. I don't know why I'm looking at it, but there's a room in there. The door. It's like a filing system or something. Don't know why I can see that there, but okay. Right, okay, I get the feeling that the museum is going to be lots of little things to look at, which means probably a lot of writing. Lots of uh, stuff. I, I probably won't read it all. The museum is based in Saxon's old town hall, built around 1819. Oh, blimey, yeah. Okay, I'll just leave these up for you to read. Sa oh, Saxon Museums. Saxon Museum uk. Oh, I've got to put that in the link. I bet it's real. Oh, okay, I better check it first. If it's not real, um, that would be a shame. Or maybe it once was, but isn't now. But if it is, I'm sticking that in the links. It's got to be there. I, I took all that time, didn't even bloody read the thing, but never mind. So that whole thing is just for that painting there. Right, that leads up to that bit in the middle. What's going on here? Be sure to check the upper gallery to view some of our artistic masterpieces. Use or something here. What's going on? Okay. That's not right. Okay. That's not right. Okay. Oh. No photography, filming, or tampering in the museum. Right, so I won't try the camera either. Bread? Do you want some bread? That's not right. No, apparently not. Okay. Right, okay, I've got... I've got to use something with that, but nothing that we have at the moment. Ooh! Three Kings of Saxton. It looks like a child. The crown is far too bloody big for the head as well. It'd be worn as a necklace. A very spiky, spiky necklace. Aldwulf. These two sons, Gunwulf and Pendrehead. Aldwulf and Gunwulf. Sound like characters in the bloody uh, Skyrim. Replace Axel Chronicles. Remember that Aldwulf is a mannered and intelligent man. So it's carried out for many decades. The way of life still echoes throughout the modern Anglia beyond. Okay. Bear that in mind. What's going on here? Let's start with this one. Don't know why, but this looks more obvious. I'm going to go this way. The new video panels can be oh, found right. in the butterfly room and upper gallery. Butterfly room? That's a camera. Okay. Can't do anything with it, but I can look at it because that's handy. Start left and go right. So let's have a look at this bit. Right. I think they're all moths. At first, I thought, oh, butterfly. But they that see that could be a butterfly. But you can get some very colourful moths. What's this one? Oh, okay, it's the same. Right, okay. Um, nothing on there. Way down that way. It's way down that way. Right, okay. Let's have a look up here. The museum is open from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. except on public holidays. Oh, when's it open on public holidays? Oh, right, yeah. This is the. Uh, this is on the loading and the saving screen. Part of like the. That's. I don't know. For some reason, that means Saxton to people. Can't look at that. Let's put our hand on this and see what happens. Ooh. 
I thought it was going to turn and look at me then, that would have been freaky. Okay. Don't know what these guys are doing here. This looks like footage from the church. I'm familiar with that. Oh, it's a real place at least, or it's very really well rendered. I get the feeling it's a real place. I'm sure his name's Gurney. He's missing a nose as well as his uh, hands. <laughs> and looks a bit like William Shakespeare as well. Obviously, very, you know, uh, a, similar, a familiar look to that period, I'm sure. Robert. I can see that one. Robert. Tim, Tim, Vim. No. JB. CJB. God, this is just going on. Right. What happens if I press it again? Oh, God, it restarts. Right, okay. Screw that. Door. Did I? Did not. Do browse the library for books about the Sanderton and beyond. Some moving furniture. Sure, that's where the vent leads to. That looks like the door. It's obviously locked. Right, hang on. Let's click on this. What does this show me exactly? The Mayday Fair. It's all that bit, okay. This Monday. So that's. So it's a telescope, obviously. You can see there. Spivey scope. I feel like Spidey Sense, but Spivey scope. Okay. 1892. Walter Spivey. Famed sea captain. And it's a lot of things on there. The Hockney Tele Tower. Trusty telescope. This one. This one checked down the spy was over there. Avert the disaster and swore that his telescope would bring good luck to all and had the good fortune to employ its uses. Oh. That may be handy to have later on. Um Okay, right, okay. Let's go on this one. Oh I don't know. what the hell? I thought they were webs. God, it throws me off. Oh, hello. It's another bloody. What's this artsy effect? Don't forget to explore it's the terrible music. Look at these chairs, look at them. Grotty and dirty. They look like they've been sat on by seagulls. Oh, right. I wonder what the green bit was. So. It's a line that's like a fine yeah. It's like a It's like a sensor. Just leave. Yeah, I'm turning you off. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's go this way. Ooh. Take the weight off your feet and watch our film <sighs> about the town. How big is this? What's with the carnival music? Has been I want to go up there on the fan. Times. I think that's the item in front, but I'm going to click there. No, okay, that's the item in front. Let's go around and have a look. It sounds like a bloody saloon door going in the background. Museum's noose exhibit. This sounds like he dropped the recording in his pocket. <laughs> An asthmatic running a marathon. What's going on? Uh, and again, it's a noose. I suppose the guy would find it hard to breathe. Is he going to say anything then? No. That'll do things. I'm not going to wait till it does. 
does the same thing. The suicide's news. A grisly reminder of Edward Molina's fate. Oh, okay. The local businessman and celebrity killed himself celebrity? in the late 1950s. But yes, yes he did. Is this his noose or just a reminder? Okay. Unusual, right? Beakers and pots. Discovered in the woods and fields solicitors. around Northfield. They are thought to be 4,000 years old. Really? The Saxton Claw. Originally thought to be Grindel's Claw. By the dragon fearing folk of ages past. Mm -hmm. This fossil is sought to date from the Jurassic era. So does that mean Grindel the dragon is Jurassic? Yeah, that's about a bit. See, I want to see what that is in the background. It looks far more interesting. Anyway, this is a trumpet. The last trumpet. A surviving musical instrument from Saxton's long-lost brass band. <laughs> well, they like a plane crash or something, and this was the only bit that survived. Long lost brass band. Yes, you do. This looks like an egg. But it's Grindel's egg. Nautical history. These items were donated by Walter Spivey, famed seaman of the Saxton Seas. Mm hmm. I've heard of some famed seaman. Nothing to do with the sea, though. Okay. The secret Saxton recipe. Secret Discovered recipe, in the basement of the Lighthouse Cafe, <laughs> this ancient recipe is thought to be Anglo-Saxon in origin. Saxton punch. A flask of Saxton <laughs> glass, punch. A strong medieval beverage. Discovered in the wine cellar of the Bear. <laughs> Probably a ton of the stuff still down there. It's a. Uh... Where was that? Hey, no, no. Over the top one, so it's at the bottom. Ooh. Another intricate looking sword. The Sax. A replica Saxon sword based upon a priceless item found in the murky swamps of Sedgemarsh. Ooh. Again, priceless. Just means no one wants to buy it. It's old. Crumbling. Nobody wants that. I see you, crows. Don't think I don't notice. What's going on here? Railway memorabilia. The old station clock and a trackman's lantern. Alright, I think more to say about that. Fine. What's this? Piano time. Rena double face records. Nancy's tune, okay. Old time music. Old gramophone recordings donated by Wesley Russett after their discovery in Oakham Church. Right. I like the way they're not his, they're just donated by him after he found them in the church. Interesting. What's around here? Bloody hell, do you want to stomp any louder? Many archaeologists believe there is treasure hidden out there in the fence. Yes, all right. Large black crows. We well, haven't gathered. Can't read the little thing you are there. They want to light this place up a bit better. You can't even... First of all, it looks like the walls are falling down as is. You can't even read some of these little notices. The museum is based in Saxon's old town hall, built around 1890. Button. I like buttons. Yes, you do. Oh, you know later, Sandy. Oh, okay. Apparently, we're taking it. 
why not? Every gamer knows you always start with the basement. Nothing wrong ever goes bad in the basement. I mean, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Uh, cockroaches. Books. Why do you need books down here? Look at this. It's going to rot in minutes. I don't think I should be down here. Well, I didn't ask you if you should be. I told you to come here. Apparently, I, these apparently these bollards and rope are just too much for us. He's crying. He's crying. Right. I think we'll deal with that at another time. By the sounds of it. Okay. Well, I'm assuming we started on one, like the first floor, or the ground floor. So up to two. Thank God we don't have to take the ladder at least. Mind the bird's nest. It had eggs in it and everything, I think. I, th I think they'll be okay. Yeah, I'm sure they'll be okay. Bloody hell. I'm there. Hmm. Very nice. This means nothing to me. I can't do anything with it. Obviously, I can tell it's Sangston, but that's about it. Again. Same thing, but nothing's happening. The new video panels can be found in the butterfly room at the gallery. Three crowns. A link to the legend. Oh yes, yes it is. Is that all you understand? Yeah, it's a lovely plate, but click them individually? No, okay, it's just that one. There's nothing to me. What's going on? Clearly isn't Saxon. It's a symbol, but I have no idea what it means. It means no speak English. Okay. Work our way down the corridor. Looks like a dead end. Do browse the library for books about Saxton and beyond. No, I don't want to. Oh, one of these. See what what it's about this time. It was a church previously. Okay. So who is this fella? I wonder if he's involved in production in any fashion or if there's just some stranger they call outside the building and said, Can we take your photo? He's gone, yeah, okay. And now here he is. Middle of the game. Who is this? Looks like a lost part of Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom or something. Devils. Witchcraft. Country. Oh, Evil spirits. Okay, I'm not hanging around for more of that. Oh, I get the feeling those videos do sod all. Right, I can use something here. What's this? Oh, Tree of Crows. Unknown date around 1800. Oh, artist unknown. Date around 1800. Right, okay. 
Mystery surrounds this stylized depiction of an oak tree and crows. There are no records of the painting being commissioned, nor is there an artist mark, artist's mark to find any to be found anywhere within the brushstrokes. Recent scientific examination by historians using X-ray techniques provide prove futile that the oil pigments seem to defy the scanner. A beautiful piece of art which will forever remain a mystery. Okay. 